Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Carly and I'm a young mom. I have two daughters. My oldest daughter's name is Cash and she's two. And my youngest daughter's name is Kimber and she is almost eight months old. Say hello. Cash is already in bed, but Kimber is pulling an all-nighter with her mom, huh? Huh, yeah. Also, a little disclaimer, it is raining outside and I'm in front of my fireplace, so you can probably hear the rain hitting the top of it um it's starting to really pour now so it's getting kind of loud so hopefully it's not too loud doesn't bother you guys but today's video is probably my number one requested vlogmas video and that is what i'm getting my kids for christmas so like i said i have an almost eight month old and then i have a two year old who will be three in january so two very different age ranges i do still have a few things coming in the mail and i also am going shopping on sunday so i'm probably going to get some ah! Somebody keeps messing with mom's tripod. No, no, no. But like I was saying, I'm also going shopping on Sunday and it's probably going to be kind of like just the very last bit of Christmas shopping because I'm pretty sure I'm done, but there's probably a few more things. That's kind of why I'm making this video just so I can see what I have and what I still need to get. So we're kind of figuring it out together. I'm hopefully giving you guys some ideas. I'm gonna show you guys everything that I have so far. This is pretty much everything. So anything else that I add, you'll have to tune into other vlogs after this to see everything that I end up getting. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get into it. If you guys haven't already, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and check out my other social medias that are linked down in my description box below. And we're gonna get into this video. Okay, so I'm gonna start with Kimber, who is my eight month old. And I go a little crazy and i actually started shopping in august for them because we were having kind of money issues with moving and everything like that so i have been acquiring things since august to give them for gifts for christmas so um i will say kimber has less things than cash does but we are going shopping on sunday so i will grab her a few more things while we're out but the first thing are these little textured blocks they have different textures and noises and sensory things all in the back I got this at Target and it was like $14.99 or something like that and I feel like she's going to love these next is this little cloud bead maze I saw this at Walmart and I thought this was so cute this is actually one of the first things that I picked up and it just has little beads and we actually have something pretty similar to this um that we got at Target for cash a while back and it just has like three rolling things with different sounds and stuff and she loves those she always plays with them and it also has a bead maze but this one will actually be hers because Cash is not a fan of sharing her toys with Kimber, even though she's outgrown a lot of them. But so this is the second thing. I can't remember how much this was. I think it was around $10, but I can't remember. We got this at Walmart and yeah, I'm obsessed with it. I think it is so cute. The next thing are these little maracas. We also got these at Walmart. Um, we got these because Cash has wooden maracas and Kimber is obsessed with them. Um, I just don't want her to hit herself in the head with them because they are pretty like top heavy. And she always is like flinging them around. I definitely don't want her to hit her head. So we got these. They're soft on this side. And then they have little uh, balls on that side. And then my sister is actually getting her. Um, it's a strawberry and blueberries. And I'm pretty sure they are all maracas. All right, next. This thing is so freaking cute. But it is a melon drum. So it's a little watermelon that has little beads in it. It's a drum, but it's also like a rattle and it folds up like a watermelon. Look at the back. How freaking cute is that? So I actually seen this on Amazon and I was gonna order it and then I went to Carter's and I almost bought it, but all of them had stuff on them and I was like, that's gross, even though I could wipe it off. So I went ahead and came home and ordered this off Amazon. They do have them at Carter's as well, but this is so cute. I'm so excited. She is going to love this. She loves to hit on things. So she's definitely going to be obsessed with that. I'm so excited to give that to her. And then this is actually the last toy. My friend Amy, who lives in Canada, made this for Kimber. It is a little crocheted cow. And she already really likes it. She's already gotten a hold of it before. But it is so freaking cute. And she did such a good job on it. I'm going to ask her like what her business page and stuff is. And I will link it down below. But how freaking cute is this? It is so cute. She also made cash ones. So I'll show you guys in a second. But this is the last way that we have for her right now. Like I said, I am going to be going shopping. So I will pick her up a few more toys. I think my goal is to get like some teethers and stuff because this girl has no teeth yet and they are coming. I know they're coming. So next I have a ton of clothes. I have stuff from Walmart, Old Navy, Gap, and Carter's. And she also got a bunch of clothes from my mom. So she is going to be set. But first outfit we have is this little orange mushroom long sleeve shirt. And it came with little leggings. 
that I thought is so cute. And then from Old Navy, we got this little long sleeve bear onesie. Old Navy was such a bust whenever we went on Black Friday, but we have like $80 in Old Navy cash or whatever. I think I'm gonna go back and get Kimber at least a few more things because we didn't get Kimber a ton of stuff because they were right on a lot of stuff except for at Carter's, but I got her this hoodie at Gap. It has little ears on it and Cash got a matching one. So I'll show you guys that in a second. But my mom got them the cutest little matching sweatsuit sets at Gap as well. And they're seriously so cute. I'm so excited for them. Next are some fleece pajamas. So we have this little cloud pair and then this little grid pattern with this little fox for Kimber for the winter because she doesn't have very many. So those are from Carter's and then this is the last thing and this is also from Carter's and it's just this little pack of onesies. So we've got hearts, flowers, hedgehogs, and then just this little flower one. And then actually the very last thing, she was sitting on them, but they are these little boots. They're fleece on the inside for Kimber because I feel so bad. I feel like her feet get so cold. So I got those for her. And that is everything that I have for Kimber so far. I feel like I don't have very much stuff for her compared to Cash, who you're about to see. But, um, yeah, we'll see. So, that's everything that I got for Kimber, who is my eight-month-old. So, now moving on to Cash, who is my two, almost three-year-old. I will say her obsessions are Bluey and Gabby right now. And almost all of her toys are Bluey and Gabby. I'm going to show you guys the clothes for Cash first. So, starting off, we have this little hat because she doesn't have a winter hat. And she always wants to wear Kimbers, which are way too small for her head. So, we got this at Target, and it was only $10. And then we also grabbed her some little mittens and these were $5 and it was supposed to snow whenever we bought these. So these were actually already supposed to be given to her, but it didn't snow. Well, it did snow, but it already melted by the time we woke up. So she didn't even get to wear them. Um, but then we went to Old Navy and I have this really slouchy like turtleneck sweatshirt. Is this not the cutest thing you've ever seen? This is so cute. And Cash also got a whole bunch of stuff from Jackson's mom clothes-wise, so I didn't get her a lot of clothes either. Her grandmas have gone crazy on them. But next is this little Old Navy sweatshirt, and this one has a hood with it. I just thought this color was really pretty. I really like neutral colors, and I got a Gap hoodie that's kind of the same color as that. So, yeah, I'm obsessed with neutral colors. I love it. And then from Gap, here is the matching hoodie to Kimber's. Hers doesn't have ears on it, but... They're going to look so cute matching. I am obsessed. I love matching them. They don't have too many matching things, but I did get them like matching pajamas and stuff like that whenever I went with their grandmas. So the last thing that is clothes is this pajama set. This just has a bunch of words on it. And then this pair. Moving on to toys. Here is the crocheted pig from my friend Amy. Again, cutest thing I've ever freaking seen. So cute. Where's the cow? They need to be seen together. Are you kidding? Again, I'm going to ask her for her business website and I'm going to link it down below. And then the last clothes item, I actually forgot about these, but it's this little pack of no-show socks. Socks are always showing and it stresses me out because they never match. Ever. Never, ever do they ever match. So, definitely needed some of those. They're so cute. They have little animals on them. I got these on Amazon for like, I think $10. But there's six pairs in here. They're probably actually not $6, but how cute are these? Moving back onto toys, we have some little people. These are the frozen ones. And they have Elsa, Anna, Olaf, and Kristoff. I thought these were so cute, and she loves Frozen. That was, like, actually the first gift that I got her before she even knew what Gabby was. I'm so sorry. She is being so loud. One of her earlier presents was these little Toy Story figurines. There is Bo Peep, Woody, Forky, Buzz, Jessie, and Duke Kaboom is back there. Um, she was obsessed with Toy Story. She wouldn't let us watch anything except for Buzz. Even though it's not like her brand new obsession, she still does talk about Forky and Buzz and Woody quite a bit and Jessie sometimes. So she is going to love these. Right next, this isn't really a toy, but it is a little bluey toothbrush set. It comes with a power toothbrush, a normal toothbrush, toothpaste, and like this little toothbrush cap. I bought this during my most recent vlog, and I talked about it a little bit whenever I was showing you guys everything that I got. But Cash used to really love brushing her teeth, and now she like hates it. She hates the taste of the toothpaste. So I'm trying to find a way to like get her excited about brushing her teeth. And oh, I don't know what to do about the taste, but she's like traumatized for some reason. Colgate watermelon toothpaste has like traumatized her. She will not brush her teeth anymore. She hates it. It's like a whole fight. Sometimes she's like okay with it and she does it, but she won't let me brush her teeth. And 
yeah, so are being very loud. You know, you're supposed to be in bed right now. Anyways, sticking to Bluey. So we have Bingo's ice cream cart. I thought this was so cute. It has a little ice cream in the cart and she loves Bingo. I think Bingo is like her favorite over Bluey actually. Got the little Bingo's ice cream cart. This is like one of the very few pieces that she doesn't have at Walmart. So we got that. And then we also grabbed the Terriers, which are so cute. They're some of my favorite characters. They are so funny in the show. If you guys don't watch the show, you're missing out because it's so good. Like I'm literally 23 years old and I love it. Okay, last three things. We found this at the dollar spot at Target and this is just a little like clipboard that she can take in the car and it has some crowns and some Gabby pages and some stickers and she loves coloring. She loves stickers. So I found this at Target and I was like, we have to get this. It's only $3. So we got it and she's going to be obsessed with it. Like I said, obsessed with Gabby right now. We've watched it for like a week straight over and over and over again all day. So yeah, I know all the words to all the episodes and all the songs and everything. If you watched my last video, you guys know that I was going to buy a little baby box stuffed animal for her to have at Christmas. She found it in my cart, so she already got that, but I'll talk about that in a second. We got baby box and Gabby's art set and Gabby actually like her clothes change. How cute is that? And I'm really curious to see the surprise accessories. Like, what's in there? I'm I'm genuinely curious. I really want to know. And she's going to be so excited because my mom got her Gabby's dollhouse for Christmas. So she's going to open all this and then she's going to get the dollhouse. And it's going to be like magic for her. So we got this one. So the last thing is this big Gabby set that I bought specifically for this one character because she is obsessed with him. She talks about him all day, every single day. She says she's Cat Rat, she acts like Cat Rat. Um, and whenever he comes on the screen, she gets so excited. So he is definitely her favorite and he does not come in a little box like this. So yeah, we have Kitty Fairy, which is another one of her top favorites. Cakey, another favorite. Pandy, Cat Rat, number one. Baby Box, which she has a stuffed animal for. And Mercat. And, and it also comes with a Gabby and surprise accessories. That's everything that I got for them so far. Again, going shopping on Sunday. So we'll see. Also, I have a few things coming in the mail. And I talked about it in my last vlog too. I ordered some Gabby stuffed animals. So I got the cat rat one, the cakey one, and the kitty fairy one. And then my Aunt Jamie actually got her this little mercat one. I think my goal for the rest of Kimber's gifts is probably like some teethers. Because like I said, the teeth are coming and... I'm not ready. So teethers for sure. I want to get her one of those. I'll pop a picture of it up on the screen because I don't even know how to explain this, but I can put like fruit in it or something and hopefully that'll help like soothe her gums whenever they're sore. So yeah, that's kind of my goal with hers. So coming up, we have a bunch of fun stuff. I have some DIY crafts I want to do with them. I also want to go look at Christmas lights. We want to go to this North Pole adventure thing. Um, wrap presents, build gingerbread houses. Yeah, so much is coming. I feel like the days are already flying. I can't believe it's already December, already almost Christmas. I'm already about to wrap presents. I'm done Christmas shopping almost. It's insanity. But anyways, that is everything. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up. But if you guys haven't already, if you don't mind, don't forget to like and subscribe, leave a comment, check out my description box. It has the links to all of my other social medias. So check those out, especially my Instagram. And yeah. That is going to be the end of this video. I hope you guys liked it and I will see you guys all in the next one.